my, you can't see my head. So this is my very, very large box of Briarfest goodies. I am currently filming in my kitchen because my studio is like a very large mess of Briarfest orders at the moment. These are my kitchen cabinets and I'm sitting on my kitchen floor. And how else would you open your Briarfest goodies other than this? Like, obviously this is the way to do it. I could honestly fit inside of this box, probably. Mojave, who I have been pronouncing as Mojave. I like took Spanish class and everything. I, oh my gosh. Oh wow. He's so pretty. This is the first regular run on the Fireheart mold, which is done by Raven Maddock of Chrysalis Studios. And it's very exciting because she actually also lives in Canada. It's just really cool to have like a neighbor, relatively speaking, with like making briars. Like that's crazy. I had to have him, of course. And because I had to have him and I wanted to customize him, I bought four. Don't tell my husband that I bought four of the same horns. It'll work in my favor because I'll get to pick which one is my favorite and which ones get to be destroyed. This one is missing like, what? This one is like, not right. That's all. Wow. It's like I have my own briar store. That's what I always wanted. All right, what else is in this big box of goodies? I'm going to show you my favorite thing that I bought because this makes me so happy. <laughs> this is a license plate cover that says, I would rather be driving to Briarfest. I needed this. Most times I would rather be driving to Briarfest and not to wherever I'm driving to. So as, as a kid, I wanted to go to Briarfest so bad and I figured out it would take me 30 days to walk. 30 days. Now we have, ooh, this is FBA's grand design. Oh God. And then I got this set, Best of Breakfast Stimulate set. Ooh. So, it's really nice. And the last thing in the very bottom is this package, Breakfast. Boogie. This year they decided in the live stream to like reveal the special runs, which is great and that was fun. And the variation for this is a Cremello. <laughs> I have an aversion to Cremello. I don't really appreciate the color. And so now we're here and I don't know if this will be the one I want or the one that I despise. I didn't want this. Am I the only one that doesn't like surprises? So this is the new Briarfest packaging. Everything was switched to paper, which is really cool. So it's all recyclable. So this is like a little paper baggie. All right, the moment of truth. I hate this gambler situation. Oh my gosh, I think I'm safe. It's not Cremello. Yay! Yes! Thank you, Briar. Thank you. He's perfect. Wait, 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 wait. If I stack all of them, are they as tall as me? Oh my gosh. That is an accurate depiction of Briarfest is when they are literally the same height as you, which isn't saying much. I am only like five foot three on a good day. So I am officially one, two, three, four, five briars in a stable mate set tall. Additionally, I figured out that I am only five and like a quarter Subway sandwiches tall. So like I tried to do this off camera and then I choked on a bunch of water. So I sound a little hoarse. Ta -da. So we already saw that Buggy was opened. So he's really cool. And then we have Single Tree, which is the main reason I purchased this set. So he's the fire heart. He's really cool. But this is baffling. So this is, I don't know who this is. Okay, you can see all of them. They're inspired by raffle horses. So this is Whipple Tree. That was Single Tree. Oh my God, they're all named after trees. No, they're not. Whipple Tree is this one. And it's the new mini Yorg model. And Yorg is like near and dear to my heart because that's who I created Yorg off of. They removed his man bits. If you know the Yorg model at all, 
he's like known for his man bits. He's like, pull out of here really, really poorly. Oh my god. Ooh, Landau? I don't know. I'm not gonna try and pronounce things. This one has a piece of tape stuck to it. Liverpool. She's on the magnolia mold. Really pretty. Hames. It's like an apricot dun Missouri Foxtrotter. I need snippy snips. Wow. Oh wow. He's really pretty. So he's got blue eye on that side and a brown eye on that side. He's so cool. How many briars have you opened in your lifetime? 300! They all kind of look the same. Wow. <coughs> oh, this is the weird one. He just wasn't painted. But it's like acetone fell on him. That is so weird. So that's him. And his hair, like look at it. It's like not painted. But it's really smooth to touch. So he is going to be customized for sure. Go as fast as you can. Open the bride as fast as you can. Snippers, go, 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 go. I would say this one and the other one are really good. And then the other two are not so good. That's okay. That was my intention. I'm going to customize them. Oh God, my kitchen cabinet. <laughs> Even the kitchen says enough. Someone spilt juice all down this one not me wheels just just wheels wow she's really pretty so this is tilly and she was also sold out so everything i wanted this year was like the fastest selling sold out you can really see the color in this light box party so this is video is so chaotic i am so sorry Woo! Wow! Thank you so much for watching, and this has been my chaotic Briarfest unboxing, but it was a virtual at-home Briarfest, so it's gonna be as chaotic as the real Briarfest, obviously. Thanks for tuning in and watching, and you know the drill. Go follow and subscribe, and check out my other social medias. You know what to do, you've been here, you've done this, it's YouTube, come on.